The weather says it's going to be clear tonight. So far it's looking pretty good. Which I'm happy about. Are you happy about the weather? I'll take that as a yes. Do I look weird? I look weird. I hate taking videos. Yeah. Um, tonight I'm going to try and shoot the Orion Nebula. So I'm going to be trying to shoot the Nebula with my 8 inch Dobsonian that I got from Skywatcher. And I'll be using my Canon 5D mounted onto the telescope to capture the nebula. You can see Chester. Huh? So Orion's a pretty good uh, target for me to shoot because it's like the brightest nebula in the night sky. That's also the largest. You can see it with no telescope at all, just in the sky. But it only comes across as a blurry star. Um, but it's also a really good target for me to shoot because it's so bright and I can pick it up with my Dobsonian and obviously my camera too, but I'll try and show you how I do it. I've only been in the hobby for like max five months, so I don't know enough to talk about it, but all I know is that I've done it before and I can show you how I do it. So yeah, hopefully it works. <laughs> Currently, all I've been doing is taking a short exposure of about two seconds, uh, an ISO of 800, I believe. And I'm just using a single frame. So, because I haven't worked out how to do the stacking yet with Photoshop. Um, I have Photoshop and I've tried a few times and it hasn't gone my way. So any of you guys have any pointers, then um, that'd be really helpful. So I need to know how to do that, but yeah. I'm gonna try and do it tonight. It's so clear tonight though, which I'm really happy about because like I said in my last video, I've had pretty much just rain and clouds and we had a few storms over the last few weeks and um, certainly for the majority of November anyway. But it's only the 21st today um, and um, yeah, the weather's been shocking, so very happy. So currently it's about 10 past 11 and I've got Orion right outside my bedroom window and I'm going to start shooting. I've currently got Orion in frame and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take a two second exposure at ISO 1600. Try and work with that really. But yeah, let's see how it goes. Considering I don't have a tracking mount, I'm quite impressed as to how much I can actually pick up with just, um, just two seconds. And you can actually see quite a, um, a lot of the structure of the nebula pretty successful so far even with a five second exposure you can pick up quite a lot of the nebula and not get too much star trailing that's the photo that i got with five seconds isn't too bad but really i need to be taking shorter exposures layering them um i guess stacking them really Still need to try and learn that, but for the minute, I'm pretty happy with what I've got. I'm going to take a few more photos, and then I'm going to edit what I've got in Lightroom, and I'll show you what I've got in the end as my final image. Hopefully, it turns out pretty good. I'm hoping it does anyway. <laughs> 